Other outdoor restrictions aren't the only rules that are being lifted. Marylanders can now move ahead with elective medical procedures. WJZ is live right outside Sinai Hospital tonight. Stetson Miller has more on what appointments you can now schedule. Hey, Stetson. Hey, Nicole, yes, surgeries, colonoscopies, and checkups are all allowed now after being put on hold for weeks because of COVID-19, but it's not exactly going to be going back to normal just yet. You'll notice your next visit to the doctor's office will likely be pretty different. Governor Hogan announced on Wednesday that Marylanders can now go back to the doctor's office and schedule surgeries that were considered elective or non-urgent. The classic thing would be, you know, a hip replacement. You know, it's painful, but it's not an emergency, and so those have been put off. We're now able to do things like that. Everything from heart catheterizations to GI procedures and even plastic surgery can now resume. But patients will be prioritized. Somebody that's been waiting, you know, to have a suspicious mass removed that could be a cancer would certainly be prioritized above somebody that needs a routine screening. But the pandemic has changed the way things work in doctor's offices. They'll be taking in fewer patients than normal so they can continue to practice social distancing. And they're also limited by the availability of supplies like N95 masks and certain drugs and anesthetics. It's not like we're going from, you know, uh, right back to how things were three months ago. This is going to have to be phased in. Dentists can now start taking in more patients, too. Up until yesterday, we were only seeing emergency patients, which was basically swelling, pain that kept patients up at night. But of course, to get dental work done, masks will have to be removed. So they're taking plenty of precautions, like at Crossroads Dental Arts in Owings Mills. They will be wearing protective shields with masks underneath. We've also put up sneeze guards at the reception area. Dental cleanings can start again, but they'll likely come after more involved procedures. It could be for a week or two or three, where we'll be doing less procedures because it's going to take us more time. So again, keep in mind, it might take longer than usual to get these procedures scheduled and done. We're live at Sinai Hospital, Stetson Miller for WJZ.